Camera calibration is essential. It needs to be done once a month to maintain trueness and precision. So let's go through how we're gonna do this. So we select the dense fly icon in the top left of the screen and you have the configuration selection. We press that. You have three choices, parameters, devices, and settings. We select devices and then prime scan. You have three choices at the lower end of the screen. Configure device, reset camera settings and calibrate. Let's select calibrate. The camera is now warming up. While that's happening, we're going to move to our calibration set. This has a white cap on and it's a hollow entrance. You'll notice at the bottom, there's a white solid shape, which is not hollow. We're waiting for the camera to warm up. To remove the camera, remember, careful, hand under the part of the camera head and grab. You place the camera head within the hollow entrance until it is pushed in and you support the camera. Looking at the settings, step one, you're going to start screwing both parts. So I'll show you how to do that. Select OK and turn. It can only turn anti-clockwise and it tells you to move as each turn. So step three, you keep on screwing until it captures the image. You keep continuing, there's 18 steps. It keeps telling you when it's captured the image, so it's now captured image number six. Keep turning. It tells you when to turn. So you are unscrewing the base of the calibration set. Reminding you we have 18 steps to this. And we keep going until this is complete. The camera is working and it's simply collecting those images. Now at step 18, ask you to insert the camera into the bottom of the calibration set, which is the white part. It's just capturing that last image and it takes approximately three and a half minutes for the total calibration. And just to remind you, this is done once a month for trueness and precision. Camera calibration is complete now. You can select OK, you remove, disengage, place your camera back carefully. You will now screw this clockwise, place the lid back on and this goes back in your kit. Camera calibration is now complete. You leave the door back onto the home screen. Now we're gonna talk about color calibration. This is to maintain trueness and precision. So we move to the dense by icon, select configuration, devices, prime scan. Now on this menu, you will notice a shade detection tab. This should be clicked so that we can do the color calibration. If this is not selected, you will notice uh, the color calibration is off. So we select shade detection and then we select color calibration. You also have the choice of which shade guide you would like to select. So you can either use the Vita Classic or the Vita 3D Master. So we're going to select color calibration and select OK. Now before we select OK, you will have your Prime scan calibration box, which is in your onboarding kit. You open it up and you take it out. And you will notice that there's some color diamonds within this, replicating what you can see on the screen. Again, how we take out the camera, we support it correctly, and we slide the camera on. Select OK. and the calibration process has started. It takes roughly about 30 seconds. It says color calibration is complete. Select OK. You then remove, 
your calibration set, replace the camera and place this back correctly so it's upside down so the, the diamonds, colour diamonds are not visible. Close, box away. And you can then exit onto the Connect software.